69.1 degrees. The official high today at the airport, so not quite there, but there were a lot of spots into the 90s. Now, today's record high is 100, so and then into tomorrow, we'll have to be closer to 100 or better uh, to break any records. So we're not going to break any heat records out there, but it's hot enough. Uh, that's for sure. As you head outside this evening, the heat will continue in your location across eastern Ohio and western Pennsylvania. And those temperatures all across uh, Trumbull County, down into Mahoning and Columbiana County in the uh, upper 80s, close to 90, still 90 up in Mesopotamia. Uh, 92 in Beloit, 92 at Guilford Lake, 87 over in Mercer. You jumped into the low 90s this afternoon. And as we take a look at what it feels like, that's factoring in some of that humidity out there, a little higher to the south across Columbiana County, where some spots approaching the mid to upper 90s. But the humidity is not as big of a factor as it will be tomorrow, uh, this afternoon. And uh, with those dew point temperatures lower, humidity tracker generally between this pleasant and sticky category uh, for tonight. Tomorrow, going to crank that up a little. So by this time tomorrow afternoon, it'll feel a little worse than it is today. As we get into Thursday, it gets better. Here's temperature tracker. Tomorrow morning, we're going to dip into the mid-60s and then climb quickly again through the day. And tomorrow, we'll try for 90 again. Not that uh, some of you may not want to hit that, but the official, of course, uh, back to 2013. As we go into the late afternoon, many spots will be in the 90s uh, tomorrow into the uh, middle 90s down across parts of Columbia and County, and this will be accompanied by uh, some showers and thunderstorms trying to develop as we go into tomorrow afternoon. Don't have to worry about that tonight. Radar's clear here at home. Uh, just a few clouds trying to sneak in. The storm system out west, though, this will churn its way across the Great Lakes tonight and by tomorrow afternoon and evening, throwing some of that moisture up in our direction. So the risk will be there for an isolated shower or storm starting as early as tomorrow afternoon. Not tonight. Have plans. Just take it easy. Drink plenty of fluids. Check on the pets, of course, and uh, enjoy your summer evening. That's for sure. As we go into tomorrow, Tomorrow morning temperatures in the mid 60s, close to 70. A warm start to the day uh, by midday already jumping into the 80s and by afternoon the risk of a shower or thunderstorm popping up and that risk will stay with us into tomorrow night and then temperatures try to cool a little bit as we go into Thursday. The chance of showers and storms will end early as better weather returns for the rest of the week. Tonight 64, a few clouds, warm temperatures. Tomorrow take it easy again if you have to work outside. 92, another hot day and a little more humid and late day shower storm developing for us only a 30% chance at that as we go into tomorrow night that risk sticks around for showers and storms should wrap up early Thursday morning and we cool down but still hot Thursday and Friday highs in the middle 80s and we stay in the mid 80s right into the weekend uh, just a slight chance of a shower or thunderstorm on Saturday uh, things start to change for us next week pattern shift underway we'll get some showers and storms in to kick that off on Monday into Tuesday uh, but cooler temperatures expected big week in Columbiana County Columbiana County Fair yeah. will be cooler so you won't be dealing with temperatures like this next week so if you like the heat Enjoy this week. Next week, not so nice. It's one of those days where you want to go home and just take kind of a cool shower, right? <laughs> Absolutely. Anything that has cool, that's yep. hydration or shade tree or air conditioning, if you have it. You Good advice. It. All right. Yep. Thanks, Paul.